President of the Chamber of Region, Gun Marit Helgesan. Welcome to our media box. Thank uh, you. Uh, let's mention before, first of all, that you are re-elected President uh, of the Chamber of Region uh, during the plenary session of the Congress. What is your assessment of the results of yesterday's session of the Chamber of Region? Well, first of all, it's a great privilege to be president and to promote regional democracy together with the chamber. So I'm very delighted to get this support. Uh, we did uh, elect a new chamber yesterday and most of the members are newcomers. Uh, and I really look forward to strong, dedicated politicians from many countries in Europe. Uh, and I really look forward to that one. Uh, yesterday we had a very good debate, uh, border regions facing migration and uh, is it a crisis or is it a, is it a phenomena? Uh, and it was a very strong uh, statement from the rapporteur uh, of this report uh, because we have to discuss uh, a European strategy how to share the burden when we face a lot of mi migrants coming to, to Europe. Uh, it does not affect only the regions or the border regions getting the most people into their countries or their, their, their regions. Uh, actually, it has a great impact on local authorities, of course, and regional authorities. Uh, but it's not, uh, they have a, the biggest, uh, the biggest uh, burden on their shoulder. And we discussed what do we need in Europe? Is it only for their regions that face the problems or should we share these, uh, these burdens? Yeah, and I think it was a really good debate. It was a strong debate because uh, it's a lot of emotions when we talk about migrants and what kind of services should we offer them. So I think to put this political uh, topic uh, on the agenda is very important. And we actually, if we uh, work together, have one strong voice and ask national uh, states and European Union to discuss uh, regulations, uh, mechanisms, how to share the burden. That was a really good debate yesterday. And a lot of active participation from the members. Mm -hmm. uh, and again, the, the rapporteur, she said we have to be a megaphone to have a clear voice to Europe and to the member states. This is not our problem alone. We need to share the burden. So what was the strategy and work plan of the Chamber in order to achieve these results? Because when we look at the evolution, uh, the process, it's really uh, in a positive way for the Chamber. Yeah, first of all, we need to discuss and we need to agree upon some proposals. Uh, and again, we don't, we don't decide, but we can raise uh, the problem or the challenge and try to discuss what kind of mechanism do we see together that can solve or at least be uh, something uh, in order to, to meet uh, and give better life for all citizens. It's about solidarity, it's about human rights, it's about democracy. So I think we, con we have to continue to put this political item on the agenda. So what are your priorities uh, for the next years of the Chamber? Well, uh, the prior we have a lot of priorities, of course. Uh, the last two years, we faced a lot of challenges in Europe. Uh, dividing lines, uh, rising populism, extremism, also uh, uh, if we need to keep on the diversity among regions in Europe, I think we need to continue along these lines. Mm -hmm. We talk about uh, how to uh, how mm -hmm. to involve our citizens. Mm -hmm. uh, so we need we have discussed uh, direct democracy, perhaps use uh, e democracy tools in order to consult the citizens, because the quality of the democracy is when we achieve. Uh, a quality democracy with uh, women, young people, minorities. So we have to continue to work with, uh, with uh, democracy, inclusive democracy. Mm -hmm. We have to, of course, uh, discuss the regional identity, how to make it an, an, uh, a benefit. Uh, and then we also need uh, linguistic uh, diversity and protect uh, the minority languages. Uh, and of course, we will discuss uh, in, the, in the next uh, on tomorrow, we will uh, discuss in our chamber uh, regional identity and integrity of the nations, nation states. Mm -hmm. uh, also, uh, taxation, uh, cross-border taxation, it's, it will be a report, so we will, of course, prioritize to discuss it. And also, we have a cooperation with uh, Root for You uh, to focus on cultural heritage uh, and how to build on this regional uh, identity in order to get diversity and good uh, democracy. So I think uh, we will continue to explore new uh, topics and also engage the 
participation in the chamber. But I think we also, our main topic is to uh, promote and protect regional democracy. Thank you for joining us, Mr. President. Thank you.